More than 67% of Australians over the age of 16 have now had at least one dose and are partially protected. The total number of vaccines delivered is more than 22.66 million. Now, Western Australia and Queensland continue to lag the national rollout pace, but they're not living with Delta lockdowns either. Tasmania is close to having half the eligible population fully vaccinated, while the Australian Capital Territory has become the first state or territory to have half their adults fully vaccinated against COVID. We know 70% fully vaccinated is the key to New South Wales reopening. While there's no set date, this latest trajectory on your screen would suggest a mid-October lockdown lift is looking likely. In Victoria, there will be some minor restriction relief for outdoor exercise and recreation when they have 70% of residents with at least one dose. Based on that 66.2% number, they're likely to hit that next week. More than 38% of Queenslanders, meanwhile, are fully vaccinated, the second slowest rollout nationally. Western Australia is just behind the Sunshine State on 37.9% and is unlikely to reopen its hard border with Victoria and New South Wales this year, regardless of what vaccine targets are met. Finally, if we turn to Tasmania, still the only state in Australia unaffected by the Delta lockdowns that have dominated the year, more than 48% there are double-dosed.